Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to what is part number two of the most epic custom card video I think you're ever going to watch ever. Because we are finishing off the absolute stack the Pokemon decal sent in for us to unbox. And I literally just showed him an Instagram DM saying he's like, the first lot was absolutely fantastic. And he told us, dude, they only get better. What's in the second half is literally going to blow your mind if you enjoyed the first. What the flip is going to be in the second half of this unboxing, guys? I think without further ado, we just go into it. We just start unboxing these bad boys and see what happens. So, without further ado, let's do it. You ready? Oh, no way! For a golden secret rare substitute card. Why has this not been a thing yet? Oh, mama. I tell you what. I flip and tell you what, guys. Unreal, no flipping way. Oh, this is how you start off the video, guys. Golden cigarette substitute for lot. Oh, that is gorgeous. What do you guys think? Do you guys reckon there should be a Pokemon card by now? Or what? I love like substitute in general is just such a cool like thing. The fact these have, have like plush toys from the Pokemon Center and everything. Really surprising, I guess. It hasn't had a card or a full art golden like the exactly like this. Unru I could stare at these all day. I'm sorry, guys. So good. All right, let's keep going. He's right. These are blowing my mind, but that's okay. Because we've got cloned Charizard Rainbow Rare GX full art card. Look at this. As if, ladies and gentlemen, you can't even see it. Is this like glow? It kind of looks glow in the dark. Scorched Earth, Fire Claw, and Flamethrower with 50. Unreal. You guys, by the way, we have to pick our favorite card by the end of today. We're going to do a recap of everything we got yesterday, everything we get today. And we got to pick out our favorite custom Pokemon card because he sent us so many bangers. But we can only flipping pick one. It's the regular full art version. Okay, now I 100% see why this card was so good. Look how good the full art version looks. The Rainbow Rare, cool. But I think you get the real, like, uh, cloned version of him when you get the full art version. 25 out of 100. This kind this does remind me of the Unbroken Bond set with the full art Reshiram and then the Tag Team Reshiram and Charizard as well, doesn't it? But this time it's the cloned one. Ah, oh, these look so realistic, man. I love the background and everything. Oh, that reminds me. Ladies and gentlemen, we have some banger rooskies coming up. Oh, Clone Charizard regular GX as well. Get out of here. So it legit is like the Unbroken Bond set because then we've got the, the regular Clone Charizard GX. This is so sick. <laughs> oh, man. It's going to be so tough picking out a favorite. That full art was awesome, though. Yes, this is what I'm talking about. Look at this. Charmeleon, Ivasaur, and War Turtle. Stained glass flipping window. Full art. Holy Aunt Jemima. Try Fracture 250 as the attack. Unbelievable. There's no words. Like, that's just the best thing I've ever seen in my life. Stained glass windows, period. Amazing cards. The fact he makes them with even cooler Pokemon, I have no words. I'm like, I'm done, but these are so, so good. What do you guys think? Leave a comment in the comment section below. What do you think of these custom cards? Do you really like them? The stained glass window ones? Okay, pause the video, take a look at that one if you want to, but we got more cards to unbox. I'm just so excited to get through these. Oh my goodness it's a snore toys oh this looks good this is looking good ladies and gentlemen hydro pump and pulverizing pancake are the attacks look at him this is the best custom combo pokemon of all time like <laughs> what the heck he's holding a drumstick that he's taking a bite out of but it's like snore like oh it suits it so well like, if you're going to pop a show in any Pokemon, of course it's going to be Snorlax. Because he looks so similar to Blastoise a bit. 
Yo, he's got a little picnic thing like he's in the old days. He's got an apple, I think. This is epic in every definition of the word. Snore Toys V card. Oh man, I, th I thought it couldn't get any better off that stained glass window one. Snore Toys, you got the back. Oh my gosh. I told you this would happen eventually. It's Appleton V card. I love Appleton. And the fact this is what he could look like as a V card, which by the way, Pokemon Company, you gotta make happen soon. Like, it's beyond a joke. It's been about three sets now in Japanese. Appleton still hasn't got a V card. This is what I'd wanna see. This is what I wanna see. Or Flapple, either one. <laughs> Be so funny if you guys like Appleton V card. That's the best custom bad boy right there. Apple Acid and Bullet Seed with 30 times. Yo, this is wild. Okay. Sorry, no one probably cares about Appleton besides me. Oh my goodness. It's literally the three dogs as like um a tag trio card. But they look so it's not cartoon. I want to say it's cartoony, but why all Pokemon are cartoony. That is wild. The colors though. They just look so good. Elemental Raw, Starter Smash GX. Oh, this is a gorgeous card, especially the purple that flows all throughout the top there. Unreal, thank you so much. All of these are going in a binder, like they have to, without a question. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shiny Umbreon with Witch's Hat. How good does this card look? I loved it. I saw this on his Instagram. It looks amazing. The purple hat, the Umbreon, shiny version 2. You can't go wrong. Got a full moon behind him as well. Shadow Ball, Dark Magic. That is a gorgeous one. That's a good one. Contender as well, I think. For best card. Although I kind of love Snore Toys and the Stained Glass Window so far. But this might be third. I don't know. Shiny Umbreon GX. Looking good. Everyone breathe. Okay, what is it? Oh, it's the Armored Mewtwo GX. Now, you know what? This is pretty sick, but it's a tough contender because there's been so many Armored Mewtwo's recently. I've got a feeling this is made around the peak Armored Mewtwo um, era, but the Pokemon Company has been doing a lot of these cards, so this is a good like take on what it could look like as a fuller card. So I strike, full burst as well. Man, these are where the bangers are this part. Okay. Next one. What do we got? About, we got about five left. <gasps> Oh my gosh! It's a winner! It's a winner! Wrap it up! Cancel the series! We're done! I'm finished! This is it! Goodbye everybody! This is it! This is the Bangaroski! Look at that! Look at that! Look! Oh my gosh! This is why... This is why this is an absolute... Ridiculous video. It's Galarian Moltres. Galarian Zapdos and Articuno. As a stained glass window full of card. This card wins the internet. Like, without question, it's the best looking card I've seen of my life. Already, like these Pokemon, I'm so pumped for in the DLC of Sword and Shield, right? But then pop them on a fuller card. That's not, that's not cool enough. Put them on a stained glass window card. Trinity Dive, Starter Smash. It wouldn't surprise me if this was an actual card they made in the future and he's just beating them to it. But, oh man, this is insane. Dude, I could end the video right here. I'm done. Put me in a suitcase and send me off. This is... Oh my goodness. I think this is probably one of his hottest selling cards too. And I don't blame it. Because that's the best thing I've ever seen. Oh, it gets better. How's it flipping get better, guys? It doesn't make any sense. Eevee, Jolteon, Vaporeon, and Flareon. Full art. Look, it's, you know what it looks like? Those, like, I want to say tattoo, but it's not. It's kind of those air, yeah, kind of airbrush tattoos that people get. It looks like that, doesn't it? But it's off the uh, Eevee artwork right there. Vaporeon, Jolteon, Flareon, and Eevee. But then the background of the colors... Oh my gosh, it's going to kill me. It does. It looks like a tattoo. I don't know why I think like that, but it kind of does. 
Let's keep going. We've only got three to go. And of course, Eternatus has to have... You know, this is a card I think Pokemon won't make because of spoilers until later on. Maybe in like end of this year we'll see it. Eternatus V, it has to be a card eventually. Look at the attack. Dynamax Cannon with a hundred times. This is in old definition of the word, epic. There's no- oh my gosh. Killed it. Literally, annihilation. You could, like, do you see the subtle, uh, stars behind him as well? I'm done. I've, like, I've lost for words. It's rare I get lost completely for words. But it's kind of how I'm feeling right now. Second off- Oh! What the flip is that? Unlisted Leaf, one of one, full up, golden, sick rare trainer card. Let's get this bad boy out. No way. No way. Huh? This card gives the player the ability to watch total epic Pokemon content on the daily. I'm done. This is unreal. This is unreal. Pokemon decals, my man. You have literally killed it. Like, there's... I've got no words at all. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a sick rare unlisted leaf card. And this is exactly what it'd look like. This is the best unlisted leaf custom card I think I've ever got. I'm shaking. Can you see that? Like, I can't even process what's happening right now. Oh, I love the attack. I love the shine too. The texture. Like, all of that. I'm gonna get this framed or something, don't I? What's in the final one, though? Like, if we've got this just ridiculous card, what's in here? Oh, of course. It's gonna be his... Isn't that good? Isn't that so perfect as to how he's gonna, like, set this out? It's his calling card. Infernos Games. So I think Infernos Games is like his actual website. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at this. Infernosgames.com. That's his actual website. I'll link these all below, by the way. He's got his Etsy as well, which is Snazzy Decals for you. And his uh, Instagram, which is Pokemon Decals. And that's how I know him. I know him with Pokemon Decals. That's him. And then all... I guess his three favorite Pokemon? Fair enough, too. Oh. You imagine giving someone that... Like, that's your business card? Just give it that out at like events. There you go. Have my full art trainer card. Which by the way, some people do. I've actually done at Pokemon Worlds last year. I got a few um full art custom cards of trainers. And it was like legit YouTubers and stuff. So people do that. Anyway, let's end today. Why we mull over when we think about what the flip did I just unbox? Let's open up our four, I mean three, um, fossil boosters right here. I thought this would make a fun ending to it. Um, vintage opening is my favorite things in the world to do. And I just feel like we should open up some fossil bad boys right now. Oh gosh, don't destroy it too bad. Especially during the times where I feel like everyone's in need of good content. If you're like in your house at the moment and you're in quarantine or something. Like everyone just wants fun content to watch and open. So let's try to make everyone happy and unbox some ridiculous fossil vintage bangers. We're going to go back. Oh man, we've got an Arbok as well. We've got a Ghastly. Dude, this is insane. We've got a Horsey as well. Zubat. Then a Gambler. Interesting. We're going to recycle right there. We've got good old Krabby looking out. Shelter. Then a Ekans. And a Zapdos as our regular rare to end it off. I mean, that's probably on the top tier version of like regular rares you could possibly get. But let's be honest, let's go for a holo card. So let's open up Zapdos if that was the last regular rare. What do you guys think of Fossil? Do you enjoy it? I love Fossil um, for the artwork and all that. But I know it's probably the least popular variant of like the old, old school because a lot of people prefer Jungle over Fossil. But honestly, as long as I'm unboxing some vintage bangers, I couldn't care less. So we got a Sandshro as the uncommon right there. I mean Sand Slash. Got a Ghastly. Then we got a Cloister. Very vintage Cloister. And I remember having so many of those when I was a kid. Gabuto. I used to get paid in like Fossil and Team Rocket boosters when I was a little kid to mow the lawns. 
Nowadays, if I mowed lawns and someone paid me as those, I'd be mowing lawns 24 hours a day. Shoulder, slowpoke, geodude, mysterious fossil, regular rare muck. Alright, we've got an Aerodactyl. Can we finish it off? With a, do you think it's possible to even get a holy card, or do you think they're weighed at the moment? I don't know. I can't even remember where I got these um, boosters from. Like, part of me thinks it was a Pokemon Rev mystery box, but I don't know. We got a Sand Slash right here. Then we got a Kingler. Cloyster again. Mysterious Fossil. It's only 62 cards. We are doubling up a little bit. We got a Tentacle. Kabuto. Zubat. Shelter. Recycle. Oh, what the flip? As if that's not holo. <laughs> oh no. Regular rare haunter. Oh, that's okay. Three regular rares in a row. Okay. Let's have a recap. Although, I should just point, let's not have a recap of every card. Let's just pick out my top three favorite customs. Let's do it. Alrighty guys, that took a while. I was like really tossing up what I want to put in there, but I think I've got it. And ironically, I think my three favorites are the ones we unboxed right at the end of part number two. So only the real OGs are going to see this, you know. But I think my- you got to leave your top three as well, even your top one. Because if I have to pick, you guys have to pick. Number three comes in at Snore Toys. Love it. Literally everything about it. The combination of Pokemon, the artwork, the way this card looks, and it's a V card. Beautiful! Fantastic! This, I don't even have to explain. Galarian Legendaries, Stained Glass Windows, put it all together. Unreal! I love the- oh, the colours too! Perfect. And this, I don't even have to explain. This is the greatest card I've ever seen in my entire life. With that statement, links down below. Thank you, Pokemon decals. I think I personally love you. But most of all, I <laughs> keep on gaming. Till the next episode, stay subscribed. We've got some bangers coming out this week. I'll see you then.